to do better than that, American. Kim, lay off. It's her first time. Okay, Rebecca, we're just going to test the brake thrusters. Should be done before lunch. Okay, sounds good. Okay, ready auto deploy. Copy, Ariel. Okay. You're good to switch to manual. 10-4. Hey, Ariel. Is sushi on the lunch menu today? That's correct. Okay, then let's wrap up this one early. Sounds good. Okay, testing brake thrusters. Trial one. Uh-oh. Hey, Ariel. Something happened. My thrusters are offline and won't come back on. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I'm dead in the water out here. Okay, Rebecca. Just hang tight. We'll send some ships to give you a tug back in. Should be 15 to 20 minutes. Okay. Save some sushi for me. Don't worry. You won't miss out. I told you. You try to save money on the thrusters, it'll come back to bite you. Yeah, yeah. You really should remind her when she forgets to mute her mic. Yeah, you're right. You metasentients are missing out. Hey, Rebecca, your mic is still on. Yeah, that's what I thought. Gomez, what's up? Forget the tug ships. They're sending a symphony fighter to pull you in. A symphony fighter?
I'm sorry. Glad you're back safe. Yeah. I guess we can rule out those thrusters. That's right. That symphony fighter saving you must have been something. Yeah, it was. I never got to see one that up close. It was North Korean. Yeah. Kim Soo Jung was the campaigner of that one. Hmm. I would have liked to thank her. How about that sushi? Yes, please. Good stuff? Yes, sir. Did you have anything else for me, or I could study some documents? Uh, well, you know, you could just hang out here for a bit. You sure? Yeah, just chill. You're paid by the hour. Okay. I can take a walk. Uh, I may have something for you. I can get my ukulele. You can if you want. Hey, sir. Glad to have you. Hello, Ariel. Rebecca, come say aye. Rebecca, this is Gomez, head of security. Hello, sir. Hello, Rebecca. Oh, sorry. It's okay. I'm sorry, I didn't catch your full name. It's just Gomez. Now, while regular citizens aren't allowed to speak to North Koreans, we'll make an exception. Rebecca, this is Major Kim Soo Jung of the Democratic People's Republic of Korea. Hello. Kim was the campaigner that piloted that symphony fighter that pulled you out of space. Oh, yeah. Thank you so much. I really appreciate. Thank you. I was following orders. She's. Anyway, you've been in Nova Zion for a month now, is that right? Uh, yes. And I hear you're doing a great job so far as a test pilot. Is that right, Ariel? That's right. And you also make for a great musician too, huh? I guess word gets around. Well, we do background checks on all newcomers. Social media, activities, all that. But I came to pay you a visit and see if you'd be interested in picking up some additional work. You mean, like... Let's talk about it in my office. Just a proposal. If you're not interested, you can go back to just doing this and it's not a problem. Uh, well, okay. You've got your full eight hours. And overtime. This is no obligation to you, just a conversation. Okay. Um, right now? Yes, right now. You're good. Do you visit Nova Zion City often? Oh, no, not much. I usually hang around shells 8, 10, and 11. You live in shell 10? Yes. You like that unit in Shell 10? Oh, yes. It's nice. Nicer than my place in Idaho. Oh, yeah? Yeah. It's hard to live comfortably in the U.S. Unless you're rich. Well, we take care of our own here. Yeah, I appreciate that. We're heading toward the Bach. The tall, dark building in the back. I forgot how big it is. It has room.
sorry about Kim. She's part of the ally agreement between Nova Zion and North Korea. She doesn't like working with Americans. You're not from America? No, I was born in space. But her position as a campaigner doesn't mean she's immune to the rules that she agreed to. I've got your back. If she has a problem with you, that's going to be her problem. And certainly not mine. Welcome to my office. Go ahead and have a seat. Cool, thank you. So, Rebecca, you can play guitar. Yeah, I enjoy playing guitar the most. Did I ask you to be here? I was not told not to be here. Hmm. Anyway, Rebecca, our records show that you were born blind. Is that correct? Uh, yes. My eyes are synthetic. Interesting. And you can turn them on and off? Yeah. It's a feature I never use. Well, let's cut to the chase. You've probably guessed why I asked to see you. How would you like to become a campaigner? A campaigner? Yes. Like, pilot a symphony fighter? And help defend Nova Zion from the prosecutors. Well, I appreciate the offer, but I'm not sure I can do that. I told you. Excuse me? I'm not allowed to say things like, Americans are weak. Okay, Kim. Watch it. Well, I've never submitted anything. Why am I an applicant? You were picked by Maestro. The Maestro? That's right. Your machine is broken. All right, Kim? Enough! You know what? Let's visit the cube. The cube? Yeah. Let's see the symphony fighters up close. Again, there's no obligation, and you're still getting your overtime. Well, yeah, can't say no to more overtime. Yeah, getting paid to go on a tour. All right. Well, let's go, capitalist. These are our symphony fighters. That old relic you're looking at is mine, the G minor seven. Over here is Kim's symphony fighter, the D major. It's pretty badass. It's North Korean. If that one is yours, you're also a... A campaigner? Yes. I'm a musician. I figured the hat would be a dead giveaway. How many other campaigners are there? Well, there's me, and then there's Kim. Then, well, one of our campaigners, Nathan, is unavailable due to a medical problem. We don't know when he'll be back. So, uh... Then there's you. It's just you guys? I was shocked too. Don't we have any help from the international community? Why would the imperialists be helpful? The UN will not lend Nova Zion assistance unless we join. Why? No one knows. Because the Imperialists are parasites, and they would sooner let Nova Zion die than let it exist with any independence! Okay, Kim, that's enough. It's the same with North Korea. Regardless, it's Maestro's call not to join the UN. So, Maestro must think we can handle ourselves. For once, I agree with your machine. Okay, so you'll need to give me a moment. It's just that I was working as a test pilot, and now... 
All of a sudden, the president wants me to fight aliens with a giant musical space robot, so... It's a strange world, isn't it? So, showing Rebecca the symphony fighters? That's right. Hey! How's the Be Augmented coming along? Well, the Be Augmented is ready and waiting. You can take it out whenever you're ready. Good work, Ariel. This would be my symphony fighter? Feeling nervous, American? This was Nathan's symphony fighter. Until he returns, it needs a pilot. It needs someone like you. I remember this symphony fighter. This was the one I saw when I first came to Nova Zion. Well then, it must be fate, or a sign, or something. I guess we can take it out, see what it's like to fly it. Fly it? Like, out in space? Right now? You're still getting your overtime, but first, you'll need an instrument. Impressive. That's right. There's just about everything we need to fight the prosecutors. Almost any type of instrument any musician could use. But for you, I recommend this one. This can be your axe. The Mad Fox. It's small. It's a mini. It's tuned a third up from a regular guitar. I like it. I'd like to try it out. Good. We can get the Be Augmented started. Oh. We'll try this out in the Symphony Fighter? Yeah. Might as well. Um, right. Okay. So, this is wireless? Yeah, all the instruments are wireless. Makes it easier. I hope I do all right. You'll do fine. It'll be fun. Okay, comrades, this is Ariel. We will be releasing you into space shortly. How well do you think our new campaigner will do? Well, she was Maestro's pick. Maestro hasn't been wrong before.
It's a strange world, isn't it? It's an unsettling notion to consider. The universe doesn't care what we think ought to make sense. <laughs>